So I'd like to invite up James Dempsey and the Breakpoints up. Good afternoon. Thank you, Ted. So um, in the past, I've done a song or two at WWDC, and uh, this year I brought along some reinforcements. So I'd like to introduce to you the breakpoints on guitar is Mr. Gordy Friedman. Hello. And as always, on keyboard, Mr. Victor Alexander. So um, over the past year, uh, there's been an amazing transition to universal binaries, and I was thinking a little bit about some of the technical nuances uh, involved. I wrote a little song that I hope you all enjoy. It's a little tune called Endian Reservations. <laughs> Hit it. Well, you might have some Indian reservations over bit flipping, head tripping, complications, getting it right, however, everybody's interpreted. Cause if your prices are changed, it might not keep things arranged like the last one did. Well, a bits make up a bite, each bit is active or it slumbers. But eight is not enough to represent the larger numbers. So bites are strung together now in twos and fours and eights. Each bite contains a portion of the represented state. Uh -huh. Oh, yeah. None of these bites is insignificant, but some more so than others. Each is more or less significant than its sisters and brothers. So do you store them least to most, or arrange them most to least? It's disorder and conundrum, that's the nature of the beast. Uh -huh. Oh yeah, I said you might have some Indian reservations over network of bite order situations what can transpire pulling bits off the wire as you will at ease your code could give up the ghost without them network to host type utilities oh my processor says potato y'all says potato Oh, two different patterns represent the same data. One puts significance first, the other saves it for later. The most annoying switcheroo since Anakin became Vader. Well, you might have some Indian reservations over file or format specifications. What is the risk dealing with files on disk is what you want to know. The file header should mention or it's simply convention how the byte should go. Well, do you have to break this code or has someone else cracked it? You can use an API that's already abstracted. Your development schedule won't be greatly impacted. Then you can blog about it like some guy on Dot Mac did. Well, you dealt with your Indian reservations, all the byte swapping, flip flopping permutations. Fixed every goof, made your code bulletproof and unassailable. And so for every bite that you had to reverse, and for any late night that made you mutter and curse, we'd like to thank you for making your app universally available. And that's all. Thank you. And thank you.